What a perfect time to make an announcement, as the Red Wings have gotten themselves a right-handed defenseman signed to a contract. The Red Wings today signed defenseman Antti Tuomisto to a two-year ELC that will start with the 23-24 season. So, what this means is that Tuomisto, the guy that has gotten signed, will not play with the Red Wings this year. The ELC starts next year, and it is only two years long. So, 23-24 and then 24-25, He's going to need another deal, assuming his ELC doesn't carry over, but we're not going to get into the nitty-gritty of that. Let's go over onto the Red Wings website, because what they did was they summarized everything about Tuomisto that you need to know. Take a look at the article on the webpage here. The Wings signed D-Man Tuomisto to a two-year ELC. Oh, that is way off. My bad. I am going to move that to the side so it's easier for us to read. There we go. Let's do that. Yes, I don't know why it was sliding like that. That's my bad. I apologize. But 2019 second round pick logged 20 points in 60 games this season with TPS in Finnish hockey in the SM Liga. The Red Wings today signed to Omisto to a two-year ELC. 22 years old, he had spent the entire 22-23 season with the TPS Turku. We're going to go over and look at that a little bit later, so we can skip to this part. A native of Pori, Finland, Tuomisto developed in his hometown with the Asats youth system prior to his collegiate career. He compiled 87 points in 99 penalty minutes in 111 games at the U-20 level from 2018 to 2020, earning the Timu Solani Award as the U-20 League's best player and the Rejo Ruth Solainen Award as the under-20 circuit's top defenseman following the 2019-20 campaign. There are a few more things going over prior tournament statistics and everything, but pretty much what you need to know is all available on the Elite Prospects page. Let's slide this over here so it looks a little bit better. Tuomisto, 22 years old, 6'5", 205, right-handed guy, so a big, hulking guy on the right side, playing behind Moritz Sider. We know with the Chronic trade, there was a little bit of concern as to how the right side with Detroit would shape up. And Tuomisto, while I'm not going to go out there and say he's a guaranteed Red Wing next year, he could very well just go to Grand Rapids or be on loan somewhere else, who really knows. This is, at the very least, depth that can be added to that spot. Here are some scouting reports from him back from 2019 when he was drafted in the 35th overall spot by the Red Wings second round. Tuomisto has a cannon of a point shot with both accuracy and power. His hands are quite smooth too, says McKean's Hockey. When he's on his game, he makes a good first pass with good accuracy, HockeyProspect.com said back then. He displays powerful strides and is hard to knock off the puck. Future Considerations writes about him also in 2019. Back in that 2019 season, he was at 35 points in 45 games played for the Pori Nassat in the U20 SM Liga, and the season after that, it was a point per game, once again with the Pori Nassat. The next two seasons saw him suit up for the University of Denver, where admittedly, he wasn't really too much of a point producer. Nine points in 35 games as a sophomore, and 11 points in 24 games as a freshman. But this recent season with TPS in the Finnish Liga, he had 20 points in 60 games played, so not terrible. In fact, he actually did produce a little bit in his most recent stint, four points in his last 10 games, two points in his last five. But at the end of the day, this is depth. This is an option that can potentially come out here and fill in some spots on the Red Wings lineup should they need the extra manpower. While he's not the most high-flying, offensively flashy type of guy, this is a player that at the very least has developed properly and has now earned himself an NHL contract because of it. So we'll see where he goes next season, whether that's Detroit or Grand Rapids, but for now, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below about Antti Tuomisto, the newest Red Wing signed to a contract. He's been in the system for a while, but we are finally talking about him in the capacity of being signed. So let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. I hope you enjoyed this video. And bye.